don't talk about it much, but um, I know maybe better than anyone that you don't just get over losing your spouse. My wife, it took me a long, long time to make peace with Reiko's death. But you know, there may be a, a path forward for you. No more you can hang on to all your good Franco memories and keep them with you. At the same time, keep the trauma of his death in the past. If only it were that simple. I haven't told you everything about what's going on with me and Franco. So there's been more incidents besides the ring and the car. Why, why didn't you say anything? Because I felt like I was imagining things. But if it's real, then... Tell me about them. It was Valentine's Day. I had decided to donate the dress I wore when I married Franco. I wasn't going to wear it again, and it had just been hanging in my closet in a garment bag. When the bag was open, my dress was torn to shreds. I know all of this seems so random on a case-by-case -case basis, but when you combine the ring, the dress, this card... Forms a pattern. I mean, you shouldn't dismiss that. I... I just feel like someone is doing these things deliberately. Sure the boys aren't upset about you and me they're not acting out cameron is so happy with jocelyn and pcu his heart is not in a destructive place right and jake and nate i asked them i asked both of them and they both insist they had nothing to do with the rain okay maybe trust me i know when my boys are lying and i don't think they are i mean i, I guess i can ask them again I need to check on the floor. I had a problem. I'll see you back at the house. Sure. It's going to be okay. See, hi, it's Elizabeth. Um, I know it's been a while. Listen, I got your card. Um, I have some news I think you'll want to hear. Is there any way you can come to town so we could talk in person? 